everyone. This is Jeff Bradbury, and welcome to the TeacherCast Screencast. We are glad that you are taking time to join us today. Today we are demonstrating a fantastic app that can be found on the Mac App Store called Essay Grader. Essay Grader is an application designed for the teacher whose job it is to read student-created essays and provide feedback in a constructive and concise manner. So let's dive right in. Okay, so this is Essay Grader 2.1, and the first thing that we're going to want to do is we're going to type in our student's name. And we're going to want to give them an assignment. And we can also put on John Doe's email address, so at the end, we can send him an email with his grade and his report. After typing in his email, we're going to look at the buttons below. We have a button here where we can write some comments of our own. We have some praise comments, and as you'll see, we have analysis, style, voice, mechanics, handwriting, and these are all things that we'll get into in a moment. We can comment on his organization. We can talk about the content of his essay. Here's a tab for mechanics. The style of his page. His documentation. And then we have a chance here with the text box to write a little closing statement about how we thought he did before giving him either a letter grade or a number grade. So let's go back and we'll grade one of his papers. Hello, John. Thank you for turning in your paper today. I was happy to read it. Then I'm going to click on Praise. Each of these boxes contains a few sentences that will automatically be documented in a paragraph form after we decide to finish off our report. For instance, under Analysis, if I click on this, it'll say, your analysis is solid. You do a great job of breaking down the subject into its most basic elements, explaining those elements, and then showing your reader how they fit back together to create the whole document. And we're just going to go through right now and click on a few of these. So maybe we like his ideas, maybe we like his format, and as you can see over here, it updates itself automatically. We'll click on some of his organization. Maybe we like his transitions. Maybe we like his lead-in. Maybe we like some of his quotes. And maybe we like some of his wording on his thesis. You'll see here that there's two sets of comments for each one. And these are all completely customizable. So you can have some good comments and some bad comments. So let's go through here and we'll finish this off. And at the end, I'll type in, thank you, it was a pleasure. And at the end, I think I'll give him an A. And then all we have to do from there is click Save. And it automatically gets logged. And John's paper is completely graded. So after we're done grading John's paper, what happens next? Well, we can come over here and click on List, and it will give us a list of all of our students and all of the assignments. And the checkbox here means that we are complete and all finished grading his essay. We have two options. We can email him, and he will get an email of the document, or we can click right here under Graded Documents, and I'll do that just now.
And you'll see here, this is the report that SA Grader produces. You'll see, hi John, thank you for turning in your paper today. I was happy to read it. And as you can see, for every checkbox that we checked off, there's a few sentences telling John exactly what he did wrong and how he can fix his paper. So I'll click off on here. Once again, this is completely editable. You can change all the columns how you want it. You can change all the co comments how you want it. SA Grader is available at the Mac App Store, and there's also a wonderful version of this on the iPad and on the iPhone. So check out SA Grader today. Thanks for listening to the TeacherCast screencast. If you like what you just heard, we hope you'll pass along our web address, teachercast.net, to your friends and colleagues. Be sure to check out our archive section on our website for previous podcasts, screencasts, and audio casts and app reviews that are beneficial to you, the 21st century educator. This has been a TeacherCast production. Join us next time for another edition of the TeacherCast Screencast.